Hello everyone, join us to see how the web inventory works. Here you can choose what you're looking for, whether you're looking for slabs or remnants. Then all you have to do is choose the type of stone you're looking for, be it quartz, granite, marble, etc. And in this corner, you will see the number of slabs available in this type of stone. Then you just have to choose the perfect slab for you. And under each slab, you have information about the name of the slab and how many are available in that category. As for the type of stone, you can also choose whether you want it to be slabs or remnants. Then all you have to do is choose the slab you want and click on it. And you can see again that each slab has its own information underneath. Then to see the slab, or to measure it, or even to download it, you just have to click on the slab you want. Then click on this eye to see the slab. Here you can see the slab in high resolution and do a book match test. Clicking on this eye will open a new page where you can see the slab in high resolution. By clicking on this icon, you will also be able to download the slab image. And right at the bottom of the page, you'll find all kinds of information about the slab, from its ID number to its thickness. By clicking on this icon, you can measure the slab. You'll be able to measure its area, and to measure it, you have to right-click every time you make a mark. And this way you'll have the total area of the slab then to clear it, you have to go to this icon and click on it. You can also measure the distance in the same way as you measured the area. Imagine that this isn't the perfect slab for you and you want to choose another one. Just press inventory and you'll return to the home page where you can choose another slab or remnant. Now imagine doing the same but with a remnant. Sometimes they're overlooked and have great potential. Choose the remnant that you think will fit your project. Then you just have to follow exactly the same steps as you did for the slab. Sometimes we're cutting slabs when there are remnants that are the perfect size for the project and here comes the importance of taking measurements. And again, with the right mouse button, we'll measure the area of this remnant. 